Hey everyone, this is Nick Frank, Practice Lead for Mobility and Energy Computing here at AHEAD. And what I want to demo for you today is a migration from an existing user's desktop. This can be a physical Windows 7 or Windows 10 machine, a Citrix virtual desktop or Horizon desktop. Um, migrating the user settings and configurations to a new Amazon workspace. So from a user standpoint, the things that they care about, application links, uh, desktop favorites, um, icons that they've saved to the desktop, Things that are going to make the desktop feel familiar to them are the things that we care about migrating for the user to their new Amazon Workspace instance. So the desktop comes up as a seamless desktop experience. I'm going to create that. I'm going to change that to full screen, and I'll see that resolution change. Um, the first thing I want to call out is the desktop name and IP address. So when we log into the second desktop, we're actually showing going from this workspace to a separate workspace. The first thing I'll do is create a new link on the desktop. Um, we're going to create a new PowerPoint and we're going to call that Amazon Workspaces. So that new icon for my PowerPoint, this is going to be an application that users are going to use a ton. Um, making sure that that's available to them when they log into their new workspace is going to be critical. I also want to show from a web browser standpoint, things that users care about. These are line of business web applications that users log in every day. We want to make sure that when they log into their workspace on day one, that they can log into the sites that they like, the things that they need um, every day that, that are going to make them effective in their role. So I'm going to create a new bookmark and save that to the toolbar. Um, this is something that users from an adoption standpoint are going to be very satisfied with. Again, not having to reconfigure the things that they need from a day-to-day -day standpoint when they log into their new desktop. So as I close out of this, and log off. Those settings in the background are going to migrate from this existing workspace to the new user's Amazon workspace, which is something that we want to show as part of a migration to um, a day one experience when they log in Monday morning to their new desktop. It looks and feels the exact same way. So to showcase the migration from an existing user's workspace to their new Amazon workspace, we're gonna manage registrations. And what this is doing is telling the client to connect to a completely new environment. Um, this is a new Active Directory connector. And so when I log in using the same user credentials, I'm still authenticating against the same Active Directory. However, I'm just logging into a new Amazon workspaces environment. So on the desktop launch, again, I'll create a full screen experience the first thing I'll highlight is a new computer name, new IP address, showing that we're actually logged into a new uh, Windows 7 environment. Um, I can see on the desktop I've created and that, that icon has followed me, that new presentation I created. And as I launch a web browser, um, the that same icons, the same toolbar bookmarks are there for me. Uh, and also the new one that I created as part of that migration experience. So personalization settings following the user from their existing Windows 7 physical desktop or Citrix or VMware virtual desktop to an Amazon workspace, migrating those settings so users are up and running quickly and don't have to spend time configuring or, or worrying about the things that they need to get their job done.